the Cold War era of heavily wheeled armored personnel carriers came to an end in the early 2000s, thanks to the emergence of a new and superior generation of armored vehicles. In addition to offering better performance, these new vehicles are also more cost-effective than their predecessors. Gone are the days when a wheeled armored personnel carrier was simply a boxy structure made from welded armor plates, sporting a machine gun turret and wheels. Today's armored personnel carriers are modular platforms that can be used to build a wide range of armored vehicles, each designed for a specific purpose, level of protection, and cost. Today, we will show you the best APC of our time. BTR-3DA The BTR-3DA is a Ukrainian armored personnel carrier that has been designed specifically for combat against Russia. It is an updated version of the BTR-3E, which was first adopted by the Ukrainian Armed Forces in 2015. Over the years, more than 700 suggestions for improvements were made and incorporated into the BTR-3DA. The new APC has undergone several changes, including modifications to its configuration, systems, engine, transmission, and weapon station. It also features an auxiliary power plant to ensure reliable operation in challenging conditions. ZBL-08 The ZBL-08 is a Chinese vehicle developed by the Norinco Corporation in the early 2000s and entered service in 2009. While in the past, the Chinese copied successful models of Soviet and NATO technology, in the 21st century, the defense industry of China has shifted to the production of self-developed weapons like the ZBL-08 APC. The ZBL-08 weighs 21 tons. It's designed to carry 10 people, is equipped with a licensed Deutz diesel engine, and can reach speeds of up to 60 miles per hour on the highway. The vehicle's good off-road capability is provided by its 18-inch ground clearance and an 8x8 wheel formula. To combat tanks, the vehicle is equipped with a guided missile weapon system with a range of almost 2 miles. The steel body of the APC is reinforced with aluminum armor plates in the front, which allows it to withstand armor-piercing bullets of caliber 12.7mm from a distance of 100 yards. Striker The youngest recruit of the US Army, the Striker family of wheeled combat vehicles was specifically designed for low-intensity conflicts and colonial wars, where the use of heavy armor such as Abrams or Bradley tanks is excessive and light brigade combat groups are not effective enough. Combat operations in Iraq and Afghanistan confirmed the correctness of such a decision. The M1126 is the US Army's first wheeled armor vehicle, nicknamed Shadow for its smooth movements. It has strong protection, including steel-spaced armor and Mexas armor modules with ceramic and Kevlar layers. Anti-mine protection is also a priority, with a double bottom and additional armor, the APC is armed with a remote-controlled 50 caliber machine gun and 44mm automatic grenade launcher Mark 19, with a detection and targeting module featuring a night sight and laser rangefinder. The 18-ton armored transporter reaches speeds of up to 60 miles per hour on the highway, and the 8x8 wheel formula and tire pressure reduction system provides sufficient cross-country ability. A serious drawback is that it cannot swim. Arma. For over a decade now, Turkey has been in search of a new wheeled armored personnel carrier to replace the Russian BTR-80. Despite considering proposals from three different armored vehicle manufacturers, the Turkish military has yet to come to a final decision. One particularly intriguing option is the ARMA vehicle, which was developed in 2011 by Otokar Otomotiv. The vehicle is available in both six-wheel and eight-wheel versions, and weighs up to 25 tons depending on the wheel formula, degree of armor, and combat module. The amphibious modifications, weighing up to 22 tons, are capable of swimming at a speed of 5 miles per hour. The V-shaped bottom of the vehicle prevents fatal damage when detonating charges weighing up to 22 pounds. The Arma can be equipped with a 12.7mm machine gun, as well as weapon stations featuring 25mm and 30mm automatic cannons. Boxer. Currently, the Dutch-German APC Boxer is one of the largest, heaviest, and most expensive APC in the world. 
The length of the vehicle is almost 26 feet, and the height with the installed combat module is over 13 feet. In terms of dimensions, the Boxer surpasses some tanks, and in price at 4 million euros, it is almost on par with them. Due to its weight of 33 tons, the Boxer cannot swim, but abandoning amphibious properties has allowed for excellent protection of the crew and personnel. The combined armor of the Boxer can withstand fire from a 30mm automatic cannon, and the mine protection can withstand the explosion of an 18-pound mine. The standard armament of the APC is a 12.7mm machine gun, and it is also possible to install combat modules with a 30mm cannon, 40mm grenade launcher, and the spike guided missile system. The Boxer is equipped with a 720 horsepower turbo diesel engine and can accelerate up to 60 miles per hour on the highway. Following the results of trials in Afghanistan in 2012, the vehicle was improved and according to experts' assessments, is currently one of the most well-protected wheeled APCs in the world. VBCI The VBCI, developed by French companies Renault and Nexter in 2008, was originally seen as having great potential for export, but it has only been produced for the French army thus far. At first, the VBCI was equipped with an aluminum armor hull that could be reinforced with titanium and steel armor plates, making it capable of withstanding shelling from armor-piercing bullets up to 14.5mm caliber. It was powered by a 550 horsepower Renault diesel engine and armed with a single-man turret carrying a 25mm automatic cannon. However, following tests in various conflict zones, it was dedicated that the APC needed refining. Since 2015, the French army has been receiving the VBCI-2, which has a weight of 32 tons due to enhanced armor and is powered by a 600 horsepower Volvo turbo diesel engine. The single-man turret has been replaced with a larger and heavier two-man turret, armed with a 40mm automatic cannon and side-mounted ATGM launchers, making the VBC-I2 one of NATO's most heavily armed APC. Like the Boxer, the VBC-I2 cannot cross water, but it has great mine protection, with the APC now capable of withstanding the detonation of 22 pounds of explosives and continuing to move even with the loss of one wheel. Patricia AMV For neutral Finland, which has never had a developed defense industry, the creation of the Patricia AMV wheeled APC in 2001 was a real breakthrough. The Finns were one of the first to create an APC on a modular platform, which attracted the interest of many countries. Depending on the armor and weapons, the weight of the vehicle can reach 30 tons, so the heaviest APCs lose their amphibious capabilities. And lighter modifications are capable of swimming at a speed of 6 miles per hour and reaching a top speed of 60 miles per hour on the highway. The Polish version of the Patria AMV, the Rosomak, showed remarkable durability in Afghanistan. Two vehicles were hit by RPG-7 anti-tank grenades, but were not knocked out and were able to return to base on their own. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, hit the subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. See you soon.